Here's how to make your own transparent watermark in CapCut. Now, if you're in CapCut and you want to have a basically watermark that is semi-transparent that you can put on all of your videos, I'll show you how to do it. Let's open up CapCut here and we'll just tap on a new project and we're gonna tap on stock videos at the very top. Tap on that and you can see trending. Let's go over to green screen because we want to add a green screen. You can choose any of these. Let's choose this one in the middle with not a lot on it and hit add. Now we don't necessarily want all this other stuff in there. So we're just gonna tap on the video and we're gonna zoom in until we only have green in here. So nothing else except the green. Now what we'll do is tap the back button at the bottom left and we'll tap on text and add text. Now you can do basically whatever you want. I'm just going to add a watermark that says Trevor Nace. I'm going to do a couple of things. I'm going to tap on style here and at the top, I'm going to choose this one with the bold outline. And instead of black, I'm going to choose white, but I'm going to move the opacity all the way down. So you can see only the outline of the text is showing, not the insert or internals of the text. So you can go through and let's go to shadow here and add a slight black shadow. Not much of a shadow. And that looks pretty good. And yeah, basically we can control how big or small we want it. Let's just put it like that. And we're gonna tap the export button at the top right. So tap export and it will export this for us. Now let's tap done and we'll tap new project because we wanna bring in whatever we want to basically add that watermark to. I'm gonna tap on a video and hit add. And then I'm gonna tap on overlay at the very bottom. Tap add overlay and I'm gonna choose this video that I just created. So you can see this is the overlay on here. Basically I can control and put it wherever I want, but first what I'm gonna do on this specific video is tap cutout right here. And then I'm gonna use chroma key to basically just select where it is green and hit the check mark. So there we go color picker and intensity. Let's bump this intensity up a bit. So there you can see it automatically removes all of that green and I can hit the check mark and now I can just move it around wherever I want. So let's just put it at the bottom left here and make sure that this lasts the entire length of this video. So let's just expand this out. We might need to just tap and hold on it. Oh, tap and hold on it to, oh, for some reason it's not working to do that. But basically just copy this over and over again because we want to expand this out to the entire video. So just duplicate this and of course you can expand it, you can make it smaller, you can move it all around, but that essentially will be the watermark. Whenever you go to export this video, it will always have that watermark in there. And one of the cool things is, it's semi-transparent. So you can see that you can see the background in the text itself, whatever is in that original video. Hope this helps. If you have any questions on that, leave them in the comments down below and I'll catch you on the next one.